Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. Yeah, I'm still in Florida. <laughs> so these are um, the Masters of the Universe bits and pieces which I picked up on my toy hunts. So, I mean, the, the thing that I'm most um, excited about is, uh, is Moss Man. One of my favorite characters, one of my favorite figures from Masters of the Universe, I saw this being sold online, Smith's Toys. I was tempted. Uh, how much was it? It was, it was um, I think it was $29.99. I think that included postage as well, I think. Uh, but it started sold out, it sold out really quick. Um, then I saw it in Walmart, and it was the Walmart that was, um, that I didn't like, because they, they went to check my receipt and I'd heard stories about it and I, I, I didn't like that uh, and it wasn't it wasn't a great experience it wasn't a great didn't have any great deals but I went to that um, same Walmart yeah because um Moss Man was he was how much was he yeah so he was he was um, 39.99 it was $40 because he he smells like pine he smells like real pine apparently um, and I really wanted him, but I thought it was far too expensive. So then we went to the same Walmart, and this is the one near International Drive. And um, I saw him in clearance. There was only one left. There was a f if, you, if you watched my video, uh, well, if you didn't watch my video, why not? Uh, if you did watch my video, you'll see um, there's a few Moss Men in there. And um, yeah, so he was, in, he was reduced to $25.50. I tried to find like a clearance aisle at Walmart, I couldn't find it. They, they just had the stickers um, in the toy aisle. So the, every, everything was, was next to each other. But um, my friend Ed in New York, he says when Walmart have a sale, they have a massive, ridiculous sale. So this was 25.50 and I thought that's a great price. Box is in great condition as well. Um, thinking that I might be able to get it back to the uh, UK. <laughs> I don't know, I, I don't know, I, I might attempt it, because I love the box, I wish they would do a lovely box like this for all the figures. So, because I love the boxes and the box art. So twenty five fifty, I got some. I got some good deals that day in that same Walmart. Um, watch my previous video on that. But um, when I actually got to the, uh, <laughs> when I got to the counter, uh, I might have said this before, but when I got to the counter, I, I um, You know, I scanned him, $11, $11. I couldn't believe it, that's less than a tenner back home. So I'm so, I'm so happy, I mean, he's, he's a steal at that price. So I'm, I'm honestly really happy with him. So I am, I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna try and get him home in one piece, but I found the Wind Raider, and that was in Ollie's, 9.99 and now I think I saw um, Shabby Geek on Instagram. Now I think Shabby picked up a few bits from Ollie's. Uh, I think including a Wind Raider, I think it was, and um, I think he might have also got, uh, what was it? Ah, oh, I, can't, I can't remember. I'd have to check, I'd have to check his post. I, th oh, I, think, he got another, I think he got a Cringer. I know he's got some of these figures already, but he got, he got another Cringer. And that was nine ninety nine as well, but I thought, I thought, you know, I don't think I've got a wind ray. I don't think I've got one. So obviously the box isn't in the best condition, but that box isn't going to make it. I'll be honest with you though, the box would make it in better condition home with me than it would from Amazon's warehouse to my house. I've got to be honest with you. I hate Amazon, but nine ninety nine that is a steal from Ollie's. So Ollie's wasn't as good as I thought it would be, but it had some good deals. Um, this is a He-Man type figure. I love Hulk Hogan. I'm not, I'm not a fan of uh, wrestling. I did like Big Daddy and Giant Haystacks back in the day. But I do like Hulk Hogan. He's got a shop here in Orlando on International Drive. Um, but he was... <laughs> he was uh, $6.99 in Marshalls. I thought, that's a steal. I'm having that. But then when I went to Wally's, <laughs> there was loads of them. Absolutely loads of Hulk Hogan's, and they were three ninety nine. So, yeah, not as good a deal as I thought it was. But I was going to open him anyway. So I was going to open him um, and put him inside the actual uh, Wind Raider. 
I was, I found this place. I used to go there years ago. It's near the um, Orlando Premium Outlets and International Drive. And it's like, the, it's like the old days. Everything is cheap. The clothes are cheap. Trainers are cheap. I've got loads of stuff. But I, I used to go there back in the day. But they had a, a really old Ross with the old Ross logo, you know, Ross for less. And they had, um, is it Str you know Strider, the horse, the mechanical horse that uh, Man at Arms rides? They had Strider for 5 99 I was tempted, but I've already got one and I don't have the space. But this, this was the steal of the century. So I've wanted this to go on top of my Castle Greyskull. Uh, lovely box art on there. Really wanted it. Um, I'd love to have kept the box. I've seen it on Amazon. I've been reviewing it. La I mean, the last time I looked before I went on holiday, it was, um, I think it was going for, it keeps going up and down in price. I think it was going for like $45, sorry, £45, and it was dropping down to £35. Things like that. $15, $14.99 in Ross. Now that is, that is an absolute steal. I couldn't believe it. I could not believe I found this for that price. So it's Point Dread and, and the Talon Fighter to sit on top of my Origins Castle Greyskull. So I'm so happy about this. But again, there's no way that box is making it back to the UK in one piece. So I'm gonna open, <laughs> I'm gonna open these bad boys up and just see how good they are. But I'm gonna leave Moss Man and then see how he, uh, just see how he, uh, um, you know, turns out when I get back to Gatwick. But look, it's, a be it's just beautiful box art on there. And the condition is perfect. No issues with the box whatsoever. So let's get, let's get these open. So I think I'm gonna start with, I'm gonna start with um, Hulk Hogan and then the Wind Raider. So let's, uh, let's do this. Well, yeah, so made by Mattel. Um, it looks so much like a He-Man figure. I don't really know much about, I mean, about wrestling, um, or American wrestling, or whatever. Um, <laughs> but it looks like a really fun figure, and he comes with his belt as well. And as I said, I like, I, I do like Hulk Hogan. Um, yeah, and it, it looks pretty good. Nice card back as well. But this, uh, as I said, if you want one, get down to one of these, they're $3.99. Let your eyes be your guide. But even, you know, even $6.99 in Ross wasn't a bad price. Right, so I don't know anything about these figures. Oh, look at that. That, <laughs> that is so cool. Look at that. Let's get them into focus. That is a decent looking figure. Let's get rid of his plastic around his arm. Yeah, so it's um, he's got a fabric top on there. Sunglass. Oh, the sunglasses. Look, he's got sunglasses on as well. That is such a cool figure. Oh, I absolutely love it. And it is. Look at the detail on these. Uh, on his boot. As I said, I don't know anything about wrestling at all, but I like Hulk Hogan. Look at that. Lovely detailing. You know, I'm happy with that for uh, six ninety nine. <laughs> you know, it's got the, it's got the, you know, it's got the He-Man Origins um, articulation. I'm trying to get him to focus. He is great. He's got his little hat. And he's got his belt as well. So he's going to be uh, flying the uh, Wind Raider in a minute. <laughs> oh, I'm really, I'm really happy with that. That's nice. I got him quite early on in the holiday as well. So let's get the uh, anything else in there. Oh, there's a little bag, a little bag in here as well. I don't know, I'll have to get some scissors. I'll check that out in a minute. So let's go to the uh, the Wind Raider. 
I do like keeping my uh, Masters of the Universe boxes, but in this situation, like what can, you know, what can you do? I mean, it's a love. Again, it's this lovely. Um, it's just lovely art on there. Who's on the back? So it's got Man at Arms, Teela, Faker, Beastman, Skeletor. I don't know all of them. Zodak. I always thought Zodak was called Zodiac back in the day. Yeah, and as I said, Castle Grayskull is, is a great place. Here. I absolutely love it. I think I think you could get it on um, Amazon. I mean, I haven't checked for a while since before I came here, but I think you could get it for like 40, 40 pounds, I think. And I've got all these figures here. But as, I, as I've mentioned, I don't, they're so expensive now. I don't, I don't buy all the uh, He-Man figures now. I look, I look for the deals. So there's my instructions on how to put it together, Chuffy Futter. And here it is here. So I'm, I'm going to um, cut this uh, plastic off and uh, set it up. So check out the Wind Raider with uh, Hulk Hogan pilot in it. I'm I'm really um, I'm really pleased with it. It, I, it looks it looks absolutely great. Now I've got an original uh, which has loads of bits missing, which I bought at the NEC before the pandemic. I bought a load of um, original He-Man um, vehicles to to kind of repair. Haven't got round to it, but this makes me <laughs> this makes me makes me want to do it. So it comes with a stand, which is just great. Lovely detailing on there as well. I mean, look at that. It's a lovely stand. And uh, it's got the, uh, the gra is it a grappling hook as well? And you can put it in and out. Now, one of the things I haven't done is <laughs> I've decided not to put the wings on because I don't think I'm gonna be able to get, <laughs> I don't think, it comes to these bits. I don't think I'm going to be able to get them off and are they going to get broken in my bag? I, that's what I think is going to happen. So I've, <laughs> anyway, I'm going to like, it's not really a great review, is it really? I've got a new toy and I'm not even putting it together properly, but come on, this has been out for years. So, so you know, if you want to, <laughs> if you want to see what it does, check out Shabby Geek's YouTube channel. Because I'm because he's got loads of um, Masters of the Universe origins. I think he's got them all uh, figures and uh, vehicles. So I'm sure he's uh, opened this up and uh, reviewed it. So check that out. But yeah, I don't want to risk sticking these in. I'll do. I'll, I'll do that when I get back. Also, I mean, look, look at look at the detail as well. And the I don't mind stickers because the the stickers. It's just pure nostalgia for me because I remember having these toys back in the day. It's a great, it's a great toy. It's a great ship. Nine ninety nine. Ollie's. Let your, let your eyes be your guide. That is a wonderful, wonderful toy, and I will put it together. Also, I opened that packet um, that was in with uh, Hulk Hogan, and there are a couple of um, extra fists. So again. I'll put them with all my Star Wars um, Episode 1 weapons and um, sort all this out when I get back to the UK. But yeah, very pleased with that. Um, I, I give Hulk Hogan 10 out of 10. Uh, oh look, yeah, 10 out of 10 for Hulk Hogan. No issues at all. And also 10 out of 10 for the Wind Raider. Very pleased with it, 9.99, you can't go wrong. So let's, um, let's now have a look at Point Dread and the Talon Fighter. 14 99 at Ross. Unbelievable. So it is honestly uh, such a shame that I've got to chuck this box. Because I think it's, I just think it's a lovely box. So who's, who's, who is actually on the front? So you've got um, Zodak, love him, got him. Uh, Skeletor, Man at Arms, Merman, Beastman. Um, oh, what's his name? I know, I know who he is. It's uh, oh, what is it? I can't remember what his name is. I cannot remember what his name is. 
That is unbelievable. I can't remember. I know him. I know him, but I can't remember what his name is. Um, in Roton, um, I actually saw, uh, you know, the turtle mash. Oh, look, and there's a. In, in the other Rotons, you've got uh, Faker and you've got. Um, oh, who is it? Tra um, Trapjaw. I was looking at the uh, turtle mashup Masters of the Universe Origins figures. Um, I, I think they're ridiculous, but I was looking at Trapjaw, the, the Trapjaw turtle figure, and he looks great. Uh, honestly, he looks great. He, they, they were selling him in, um, I can't remember if it was Walmart or Target. It's on one of my videos. But yeah, 14, $14.99 for this at Ross. Get down there. There was, there was two. Well, there was two at the one that I went to, but I can't, I can't even remember where it was. I've been to so many um, superstores and shops and, ah, oh, honestly, GameStop was amazing. Uh, so, so, so many deals out there. But yes, this has got down the bin. But the, one of the things, I mean, I really want this. I really, really wanted it. But one of the things that put me off, I could only see it available at a reasonable price at Amazon. And as I say, I don't buy from Amazon because they're just useless i'm kind of thinking if i'm going to pay a, a, a high price i want the box to be in good order but oh, such a shame let's get this bad boy open i think this is the one that i'm the most excited about wow look at that that's proper nostalgia in there Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get all these bits out and uh, set it up and uh, see what we've got to uh, play with. But really, um, really well packed. I, I, absolutely, I, I absolutely love it. I'm, I'm so, so happy with this. So, uh, yeah, let me set this up and uh, we'll have a proper look. Right, so check this out. So Hulk Hogan is piloting the Talon fighter. It is absolutely beautiful. So I put I put the handle on it, and um, I mean it was you didn't have to actually put anything together. It was all in one piece. And look at look at the inside. So you can fit two uh, two two figures. Absolutely love it. Fourteen ninety nine. Right. So I've <laughs> it comes with a, it comes with the feet. Again, this is just a rubbish review. What shabby geek. <laughs> <laughs> but it's uh it comes with the uh comes with the, the actual talons the feet so it's a lovely lovely bit of kit and it comes with the uh the two wings now similar to the other vehicle i'm not going to put it <laughs> put it together because i think it's going to be too hard to take it apart and it, and it's and if i can't get it apart it's likely to break in my suitcase so yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll have a proper, I'll have a proper look at it when I, when I get back to the UK because I want to put the, um, I want to, I want to put the kind of uh, point dread on top of my Castle Greyskull in the toy room, but that is beautiful. Again, it's got the stickers on the back, but that's old school. That's proper nostalgia as far as I'm concerned. So yeah, the the the, um, the wings and the talons. They fit easily on there, but I don't think they're going to come out easy. And then, this is the actual uh, um, point dread that goes on top of Castle Grayskull. And I remember this, because I never had Castle Grayskull as a kid. I've got the original now, but I, know, I never had it. But I remember this extra piece, because I used to have the uh, comics, which came with the uh, He-Man figures. And he, and he should sit on there. Obviously, he needs his... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this is talons first and um, if you take this bit off you can have it you can have a gun on there instead so there's other accessories but I, I love it I think that's great I'm really happy with it 14.99 honestly if you <laughs> if you're anywhere near Ross for less check it out but I've been do you know what I've been to so many Ross for lesses on this uh on this uh, holiday, because my, my wife loves it. I only, I only saw, I only saw um, this in one Ross, and that was at the start of my holiday, so uh, maybe they're all gone. 
but 49 was just a great price. But look at that, let your eyes be your guide. That is, uh, <laughs> that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I'm, I am gonna miss this, uh, this games room. I've had, I've, I, um, I didn't start using the games room until kind of towards the end of the holiday. I've had, I've had a few good games of uh, pool with my son. Couldn't get the arcade machine to work. But yeah, it's really, it's, honestly, it's really, really good in here. And uh, I did mention um, that the uh, table right, right behind the pool table was a uh, was foosball, and it's and and yeah, my wife quite rightly pointed out when she was watching back the video that foosball is table football, and this is air hockey. <laughs> so I stand corrected. Oh look, look at the details on the eye. It's like a nice bit of orange there. But yeah, with this and the. Uh, Wind Raider. Just, just fantastic deals. Fantastic, deals. and we will see. Because I haven't packed my case yet, we'll see what happens with Mossman. <laughs> get down to, get down to Walmart. Eleven dollars is unbelievable. But yeah, that is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.